Let's make some Halloween driveway lanterns using our Forever Laser Dark 2 Step and our Creo 8432 White Toner Printer. First, let's get our file all ready and import it into our digital factory rip. And we're ready for printing. Do -de -do 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 -de -do Now let's marry our A and B sheets. 300 degrees, 90 seconds, mm, slight to medium pressure, and don't forget your silicone sheets. I couldn't find my silicone sheet. Okay, we're all done marrying those. Don't forget, keep your paper close to the heat platen as possible. Peel it corner to corner, and don't stop mid-peel. Look at those adorable bats. Now grab your trusty scissors. Let's trim around all four sides of your A-foil sheet. Let's get rid of all that extra adhesive that could have transferred over. Head back to the press, grab your cute little paper bag, grab your printed A-foil sheet. Let's get those lined up nicely. Grab your silicone sheet and cover those. We're gonna press these medium pressure, 300 degrees for 30 seconds. Okay, now that we're all done pressing, we have to let this cool before we peel the A-foil off. So just find a cool table, lay it face down, and let that baby cool. Now that we're all cooled off, what we're going to do is we are going to roll that transfer off of our bag. Rollin', rollin', rollin'. Final step, put that bag back in that heat press and let's seal it in. 300 degrees, medium pressure, 30 seconds. Once that final step is done, just peel off your silicone sheet, let it cool for just a second so you don't burn yourself, and then you should be able to open your bag right up. Oh my gosh, how cute are these? I cannot wait to see them lining my driveway this Halloween. Reveal time. Follow us at createwithcreo.com.